Hello everyone, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use the Point Light 2D and have dynamic shadows in Godot 4. To get started, you need to have some sort of background. This is because the point light will not appear on just the regular background. It needs to have some sort of object to be on top of. Now, let's create that Point Light 2D. And I have made a circle PNG, but you can use any, any PNG. And let's drag out this intensity a little bit. Let's enable shadows. You can also mess with the range if you would like. Now, let's add in a light occluder 2D. This is what you will be using to create the shadows. So now, let's create a new polygon. Make sure you're on your mouse tool. Click the plus, and now you can add the points for your occlusion. And now, as you can see, when we drag around our light, we will get dynamic shadows because the light is being blocked by this occluder. We can create as many as we want. So let's reset it. Create any type of shape. Oop, create one. Could be any type of shape you would like. And it will work just the same. And you may see that there is an outline here. Don't worry. This is only in the editor. Because if we add in a camera, these black outlines will disappear. And it will just be your light. And technically, since this is just a texture, we can drag and drop any sort of image we would like, and it will work just the same. Anyways, guys, hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you.